Hello, everyone. Thanks for tuning in. Let's learn from number 22 today, which is the fifth uh, hell of beasts that Master has observed. Those who only made excited, screaming, cackling noises and made no contribution to the world are herded together as monkeys, uh, groupies for stupid music, etc. Number 22. Those who only made excited, screaming, cackling noises and made no contribution to the world are herded together as monkeys, groupies for stupid music, etc. Thank you, Master. Ooh, ouch, ouch, it hurts. Uh, um, <laughs> this, this one shocked me, surprised me, but it makes sense when Master says, when Master said, uh, those who made no contribution to the world. So, you know, going to um, a concert is, is fun, it's fine. Uh, but there are people who just live their life fully only for that excitement and nothing more or less in life. Just That's just their excitement in life. They just go to a concert. They just, you know, they love the music and they go home. But, of course, it's not bad. Uh, music is not something that's bad. But, of course, there's good music and bad music. And that's, that's one thing that Master did teach us before. But if you end up living your life only for pleasure, uh, which is called hedonism, uh, meaning that pleasure is the most important part of life, or the more, most important value of life, uh, well, first thing, it leads to materialism. Hmm. And you lose spiritual values, and you lose human dignity, which leads you to being less and less as a human, more and more like an animal, hence you end up in the hell of beasts. But if you were just screaming and making cackling noises at a concert all the time and that was the purpose of your life, uh, without any contribution to the world, you turn into a monkey. You know how there's a group of monkeys? Have you ever seen those videos where there's like a, a herd of group of monkeys just like making that like screechy noises? That's what you're going to end up like. Man, this is... Laws of cause and effect. Uh, laws of causality cannot be denied, and it cannot, it always, you can't bend that law. It always works. And uh, I was just shocked of how accurate this is. And secondly, I was struck in awe because of how, you know, Master wrote 100, 100 of these sentences in a day or two. So you can't make this thing up. It's reality. He literally saw a hell like this. So mm, let's be careful um, to not drown in pleasure or just living for a hobby only. Don't, don't lose sight of mm, a higher purpose as a human being. And never forget that we were born here for a spiritual purpose. Or else this sort of hell may await you if you're... Well, I, I guess, like, let's say that you're just partying all the time, I guess, in America. Uh, you're always going to parties. Going to... Hitting a party is just, like, the best form of happiness. Well, I mean, you're going to continue doing that, but not in a human form anymore. But as monkeys, not being able to enjoy that music or the alcohol or that sensation or whatever. And, um... Until you feel how stupid it was. Uh, so, pretty harsh, but... Whew, I wonder how many people are falling to this hell these days. Uh, let's be careful. Those are my thoughts. What do you think? Please your thoughts in the comment section. See you again tomorrow. Bye.